Good evening, I'm Larry Eastup from the Central Illinois Weather Network. We do have another tornado warning now in portions of southern and south central Illinois. Let's go straight to the radar and we'll show you what we're talking about here. This particular cell, which is part of the same cell that came through St. Clair and Washington counties earlier, the National Weather Service in Paducah now issuing a tornado warning for eastern Perry County in south central Illinois until 8.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. That's for this uh, cell right here. At 7.29 p.m. Central Daylight Time, National Weather Service Doppler radar indicated a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado five miles northeast of Pickneyville. Again, that would be Pickneyville right here, so five miles northeast of that, moving southeast at 15 miles an hour. Locations in the path of this storm are Tamora, which would be, um, or Tamaroa rather, that would be uh, almost uh, instantaneous uh, at the moment, and then DeCoin, uh, where they have the um, fair in the fall, the state fair, uh, the original location of it uh, in the fall there uh, over Perry County. That uh, will be also in the path of this. Public officials reported a rotating wall cloud 10 miles west of Tamaroa at 729 this evening. So that would be here. Uh, this uh, radar image just now updating, and uh, this is really starting to uh, fan out here. So I would say just on the uh, doorsteps right now, Tamaroa, and uh, approaching DeCoin, and also um, just to the east of Pickneyville right now. Let's put velocity mode on this and see if we're seeing uh, those reds and greens mixing together. And really, yeah, we're seeing that um, very bright green, very bright red, uh, fairly close to each other. Again, in this rotating wall cloud, that would be fairly consistent with that. Let's put uh, this in motion and see uh, what it looks like as it's coming in here over the past half hour or so. We don't see a whole lot uh, in that image from around uh, 7 o'clock, but watch this here. Start to move into your screen and start to move into the red polygon here where the tornado warning is in effect. And it's loading the next image here. You'll see this uh, really start to wrap up and get more concentrated uh, uh, circulation here. And you're also noticing dry air here where we're not getting any returns at all uh, kind of feeding into this storm. Watch this bright green here, kind of uh, start to mix with this bright red just to the south of Pickneyville. This is about uh, five, ten minutes ago. Now we'll put it a little faster here in motion, and you can see, again, you got red and green together. That shows us uh, most likely that we're getting uh, some spinning going on fairly close to the surface, and that would be the reason, again, for this tornado warning. Let's come back to the most current view, bring back velocity mode, and or rather bring back reflectivity mode, and put a path cast on this for you, try to give you an idea of exactly where uh, the nastiest part of this cell is. Again, uh, looks like DeCoin, you should be seeing this on your doorstep as well. I bet we're getting very large hail here in the Tamaroa area, even all the way back uh, west of Pickneyville, some large hail possible, but see this kind of wrapping around here, backwards C, uh, and then we got the V notch here, which tells us we're getting some uh, dry air flowing in. Uh, so this would be the area here I would be mostly concerned about for the possibility of tor a tornado in the DeCoin area. Again, 10 miles west of Tamaroa about 10 minutes ago, a rotating wall cloud. So anywhere from here down to here. Let's put a path cast on this, uh, take it from about right there, uh, moving southeast at 15 miles an hour. This would be, uh, oh, we had it there. Let's uh, try that again. 15 miles an hour, and we'll show you here the towns that uh, this would be showing it uh, into Christopher by uh, 837. Um, let's come up a little farther north here and uh, try to take the bottom part of this storm uh, towards the southeast and again show you this would be in St. John's by 811, DeCoin by 816, and Dowell by 828. Again, this uh, warning in effect until 815 p.m. this evening. This is a very nasty looking cell, eastern Perry County in south central Illinois, under a tornado warning until 815 p.m. Folks in Jefferson County, uh, Mount Vernon, looks like this is going to go to the south of you, but folks in Franklin uh, County over the West Frankfort area, Benton, uh, also be on the lookout uh, for this cell as it moves towards the southeast. And uh, even in the Carbondale Marion area, we have some pretty nasty storms uh, over northern Randolph County right now that will be moving your way before dusk within the hour or so. That's the latest from the Central Illinois Weather Network. Stay tuned for the latest weather information.